Hi, I am Santiago Santos, and we are going to talk about of the green asphalt. Before we start, do you know what the conventional asphalt is? Asphalt, it's a mixture of such substances composed mainly for hydrocarbon mixtures. The asphalt bitumen combined with gravel and crushed rock it's used for paving into the construction. Green asphalt, it's a project that consists in recycling and incorporating all kinds of plastic or PET to the asphalt mixture, and that's used for building roads and lanes. Green asphalt project was sponsored by an organization, an organization of Coca-Cola and was proposed for uh, the UCR, the University of Costa Rica, from Costa Rica. They, and they look for, in this project, an asphalt that become more eco-friendly and sustainable than the asphalt conventional. Thank you. Green asphalt is a project that consists of recycling and incorporation plastic or PET into the asphalt mixture using to build streets and highways, which impacts the construction quality of the infrastructure, the co economy and the environment of Costa Rica. What is recently? In the environment, everything can be recycled. Although uh, accumulation of armored metals of environment, which were mentioned in the example of the volcano due to highly concentrated emission of metals, or the cause of the oil spill must be dealt with through speak and protocols. A new asphalt mix included in Latin America that includes pet plastic for recently bought bottles with these components could increase the useful life of roads and become alternative on environment sustainability, as well as the construction and repair roads. The technique consists of adding polymers or plastic, the conventional as asphalt mixtures in order to improve their mechanical characteristics, that is re resistance to deterioration to the water facts and the vehicle weight. Hi, I am Humber Navarro Moran from the 6B. My register number is 17307.79. I am currently standing in construction at Cedis High School. Today, I am going to tell you about the use of plastic on asphalt. The concept of green asphalt encompasses a whole series of novel techniques, whose common characteristic is to minimize the impact of the environment, either directly in the process of manufacturing and spreading mixtures in the construction of roads, or indirectly contributing to it, used to reduce other types of conditions. The use of plastic on green asphalt is really interesting and very important, because plastic is a material that we have everywhere that we use in the day-to-day -day of our lives and unfortunately is a material that affects our, the environment when it is so longer in use. So if we use it in an asphalt, it would be a wonderful idea to throw it away or give it a second life with affecting the environment and supporting the structuring of some conductor works, which is why I think it is so a good idea to continue researching how to make this green asphalt Signed, it will bring many benefits to the world in which we will be in the future. We know that Costa Rica is a small Caribbean country. It has one of the most stable economies in the American continent. And this country also has great policies of environmental protection. The project of green asphalt started to be known in 2018 when a very popular company, Coca-Cola, launches a new vision, World Without Waste. The new project of green asphalt involved private and public collaborations. The Laboratorio Nacional de Materiales y Modelos Estructurales, for its acronym LANAME, is part of the University of Costa Rica and has been working for a long time in new mixtures of asphalt with plastic waste.
Lana Mess said in 2018 that they have been working passionately in Green Assaults for seven years. And they know that this project could have a great impact in society. In this way, with the support of the big company Coca-Cola, the laboratory started to make an asphalt where PET plastic can be part of the components. Plastic can substitute materials like sand and gravel. This represents a big benefit. It reduces cost of production and gives a second life to plastic. The second phase of the project is to prove the performance of the green asphalt in some streets. There are many barriers to implement this kind of technology, but I hope in the next years we can see more countries with green asphalt. Hi, my name is Sofia Cornell and I'm going to explain you what is the present and future of green asphalt. Well, nowadays green asphalt is thinking for the future. However, there are some countries that have probably started with the implementation of this. One of them are Costa Rica, which is the country most advanced in that topic. This is possible because Coca-Cola is involved in this project. They provide the bottles that are no longer used so they can be recycled. They estimate that by 2013 they will be able to recover half of their bottles. Also, it is expected that greenhouse gases decrease in the future and that less energy will be, will be used in the manufacture of the green asphalt. As we can see, Costa Rica has a lot of advantage over us. So we, so we can only wait which country will be the next to put this method into practice. Thank you. My name is Jorge Barbosa and I am going talking about the benefits of green asphalt. As my colleague is previously, it is a project that fits perfectly with our global sustainability goal. A world without waste, note that we will be recovering and reducing plastic PAT to rebuild roads, explains William Segura, manager of public affairs and communication for Coca-Cola in Central America. In this way, the plastic in the bottles replaces materials from the asphalt mixture such as stone and sand, um, representing a reduction in a cost and environmental benefit at the same time. Science and material that we will be a waste is recovered and the expensive extraction of materials from nature. In this way, we will change the way we use the resource that environment gives use of the benefits such as less environmental impact, propose another way to use the green asphalt, and economic benefits such as saving be using fewer resorts, therefore less economic expensive.